like whipped cream. And, uh, This was too easy, yeah. Yeah, easy for you. We're out of time. Yeah. Well, well, we're just going to have to cut something out of the middle. <laughs> <laughs> On this show, that's not going to be hard to do. What are we going to make today? We're going to make some jambalaya, some chicken jambalaya. That's usually made with shrimp. Well, today, because you're here, Joy, we're going to make it with chicken. I, I, you're doing this out of respect to my religion. Out of, out of respect to your religion. religion. We are not allowed to eat shellfish. Oh, right. I didn't know that. Yeah, it's a fact. Yes. That's, that's right. That's oh, I thought maybe because there was ham in the food. Well, no, no, the, no. the recipe it does ham call. Is here. The, the <laughs> recipe does call for some ham. Yeah. But again, uh, out of respect that's to Joy's religion, we're yeah. using some kosher all beef sausage. Oh. Yeah. Which should be just as good. You know, Do you know what good. jambalaya means? I yeah, I don't. I really don't know what it means. I, I, I know what it means. What? what does it mean? It means make a substitute food for the Jewish people. <laughs> Okay. Now, what, what jambalaya really is, though, it was the Cajun people down in, in uh, New Orleans used it uh, to uh, fix up the, the, the shrimp that had been in a, in a cupboard too long, and it had gotten a little tainted, and with all the spices and, and peppers and stuff that goes in it, it kind of covers that up. So you're yeah. feeding us tainted food. Well, no, not, no, we got fresh chicken. You know what bothers me mostly, Bob? We what? have to accept everything he says. That's I don't right. know what he's talking about. Do you know what he's talking about? Let's just not but I think it. we really should get started. You know? I think we should. Why don't we cook? Where's Why don't we cook? Uh, where's our stuff? Well, we've got to get. Uh, we've got to get the. Uh, we've got to get the uh, stuff out. Now we have to have a sharp knife to cook. We know that. Okay. And, and if you excuse me a minute, I'll get in the refrigerator and we'll get out the. Uh, what are we going to get out? We're going to have some. Some. I thought uh, he'd never leave. <laughs> <laughs> we've got some peppers here. We have got some onion. We got some garlic. Garlic. Come back here. The garlic. The red pepper. That's a very expensive pepper. This comes from Holland. And it's very sweet, but it's also very expensive. As and a person that doesn't eat peppers and doesn't really know about peppers, <laughs> when you go to the market, how do you judge a pepper? I mean, how do you know it's good? Well, you get a nice, smooth pepper that's not wrinkled, because peppers are like people. When they're wrinkled, you know, we, we don't want them. We, you know, we don't, don't want them that way. Uh, but anyhow, we... Uh, Is he suggesting I leave? Uh, <laughs> Looking at me, <laughs> oh, he could never accuse you. Of no. You ain't got a wrinkle. No, no, no. These are these, but these are nice peppers, and uh, yeah. uh, so we're going to cut these in, in little in little strips. Uh oh, this pepper doesn't look all that good. We're going to cut that off. Uh -oh. We don't want we don't want that on there. We're going to we're going to get rid of that. As long as I've known him, I never knew he knew I that much about cooking. Really? Now we're going to cut these in like half inch wide strips. Now you've got to have a sharp knife when you cook. You can't you can't right. you can't cook with a dull knife because. No. Uh, and you gotta, you gotta be careful. You get up there a little close. You get a little finger in your food, which is. We're gonna, we're gonna cut this onion into eighths. Well, they say the thing is, if you peel it underwater, it won't make you cry. But I've never been able to ever hold my breath that long. I see. I get it? A joke underwater with the onion? Can't hold his breath that long? He's funny too. My goodness. No, no. You know what? We forgot to peel this onion. Oh, yeah. okay. Now, well, I thought this was a new should, method. Yeah. <laughs> no, should, no, we're going to be all right. We're going to be all right because yeah, that outer, you, when you that outer the onion, is going to just fall right off. kind of music. Da, yeah. da, 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 you, you know, Joy, Joy you, came, you came over here to eat with us, and now, yeah. whoops, you were in the kitchen here, and yes. you're, you're totally breaking my concentration because I, this onion should have been peeled before I cut it into eighths. And, and, you uh, sent him into the vapors. We're, we're, but that's the way it is. We yeah, don't want that. He's dumb or I'm very influential. Yeah, you are influential. Okay. Okay, so much for that onion now. That's all right. Now that's okay. all right. Now we got to... Uh, now what quantities are we using? You've got one medium-sized onion and uh, one red pepper and one green pepper. Yeah, and the onion's cut in eight pieces, right? And the onion's cut in eight pieces. Is there any reason for eight pieces? Yeah, it comes out even. 
And you know, cut you, but you can't count higher than eight. Is that no, you right? cut it. You cut it in fourths, and then you cut the fourths in, in two, and that makes eights, and it comes out even. Do you but sharpen you, that night, John, before each? Oh yeah. Oh, you bet. You bet. Yeah, yeah. Has to be kept very may sharp. I, may yeah. I ask you? Can I come back some time when you're sharpening the knife? Just oh yeah, yeah, thank yeah. You, John. In fact, if you do well, Joey, you might be a regular on here. You know. John, you ever threaten me like that again? I'll, I'll never talk to you as long as I live. What do you I think, like Barbara? Barbara? She's a good laugh. What, what do you think, Barbara? Huh? You're a good cook, but she's a good laugh. What do you think, Barbara? Well, I feel safer now, that I have so much. Now we're gonna now this now this garlic. Now we're back to we're back to cooking. Now this we're we're going back to to chopping this up, and, and it don't have to be really fine, but just enough to it spreads the flavor around through the through the food. Now we're gonna put all this back in the in the uh, Bowl. with the onion and the and the. Uh, Not one of these pieces. Well, that that's that wouldn't hurt anything, Barbara. No. Okay. Why are now, you chopping it versus using a garlic press? Well, because uh, I really don't know. I really, depends on what you're doing. And this is where we're going to saute the, the garlic. You, I know you want to chop it. What is the difference, Joey? When you do it with a garlic press, you don't look like a chef. When you do it with a knife, you yeah, don't yeah, look like yeah. A it's, chef. it's more photogenic. Okay. That's now it. we're okay. going to take it. Now you can do this with a with a regular frying pan, but a wok is is. Uh, is a lot better. Well, it's got higher sides. No, this is a wok. This is a wok. It's a wok. It's a Chinese frying pan. Now, Joy, if you'll move down just a little bit, uh, we'll get down here to the to the range. I'll move, but I'm still on camera. Please, you'll be on camera. <laughs> okay. You'll be on camera. Just move on down. Just right on down. Ooh. Keep moving. Okay, Joy. All right. Okay. Right further? here. All right. Now we got it. Now we got it. Okay. Now we're gonna get a little fire under this wok. Okay. Okay. That's gonna get very hot. Okay. Now. I'm not really hungry. Yet. I will be when the time he's through cooking. This is this is some vegetable oil. We're going to put about two, three, four tablespoons of vegetable oil in there. See? Is this uh, is this a low calorie dish? Oh, very low calorie, very low calorie. Yeah. I love the way exactly. he announces everything. Okay. Okay. All right. It's now I, let's see. I think we need. Excuse me a minute, Joey. It's all yeah, right. I'm not upstaging okay. you here. I'm just. If uh, I find out that he's eating when he turns his back like that on us, yeah, I'm going to no. get upset. Now we're, we're, he goes to the refrigerator, eats something, we're in good back shape. here and makes out he's cooking. We're in sure, good he's shape. Sure, he's not going to eat this. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now we probably we probably got plenty of heat there now, already. Are we going to get think? burnt from this, or is uh, well, I don't know. It all depends. Let's see what happens. That should start. Oh yeah, wonderful. Is this a vegetarian dish? No, no, no. Oh no, we're going to be we're going to be putting a lot of a lot of good uh, chicken and sausage in here. Yeah. Now I thought that when you're cooking different types of vegetables. Different types of vegetables take longer to cook, some vegetables uh, than others. That's right. But onions and peppers just take about the same length of time, so you can throw all these in there together. Uh, what about the garlic? The garlic takes about the same length of time as the peppers and the and the uh, onions, so we're fine. Okay. Now, now this, this recipe calls for a quarter of a of a teaspoon of, um, of crushed red pepper, and this is about, oh... Uh, now, if this, this dish is going to be for us Westerners, so we can use more of this than... Then if you were from Ohio or Illinois, yeah. someplace like that, you wouldn't want to yeah. use a lot of that. You know, quarter of a teaspoon. Yeah, and then a quarter of John's palm. And then a quarter of a teaspoon Simple of salt. To remember, folks. Now, now a little bit of salt. Okay. Now this is getting pretty close here. I, I don't know. That looks like a lot of salt. Well, no, it's just that's not much salt. Uh -uh, no. You imagine how much salt is in the ocean? You know, where those shrimp come out of when they make this jambalaya with. You know. It smells good. All right. Now, in fact, that's about where it ought to be right now. What is this here? We don't want that. All right. Good toss, John. <laughs> All right. Good toss. Okay, we're gonna, we're, gonna, we're, gonna set this, we're gonna set this aside now, and we're gonna get a chicken. A chicken? Okay. Out of the refrigerator, right I'm, here. I know he's eating while chicken. our backs are turned. I just know he's eating back there. I don't care what he tells us. No, I hate to. Oh yeah, and our. Uh, oh yeah. Where is, here don't forget the kosher hot dog. We got we got the kosher kosher. Okay. They're not hot. They're they're, they're yeah. sausages. They're they're kosher sausages, and our uh, our chicken here. Now these are these are these are skinless. Now we're uh, coming back here again. We're coming back here okay, again. Okay, I just want to know. Skinless uh, uh, chicken, oh, breast. chicken breast. Boneless chicken breasts. Yeah, yeah. Terrific. They're terrific. They're very expensive too. They are. Yeah, you can yeah. save a little money on this dish by buying you know the. What. The, well, with the skin lesser and all, and, and and use the skin to make a chicken broth with, or you know something. So, but it's less fattening if you don't have the uh, yeah, but skin who, on it. Yeah, but stuff that's that's not fattening isn't really good, you know. To be good, it has to be a little bit fattening. 
You notice I don't butt in when he's got a knife in his hand? Did you notice? Because <laughs> I, I stay here quietly minding my own business till I he gets the knife. Me in between the two of you. Don't worry about it, honey. <laughs> you see the way he flipped that little onion peel before? Uh -huh. We can trust him. Okay. Okay. Yes. I don't know. That's an awfully big knife, John. Do you need something that large? Well, do you not. Do you use a smaller knife? Well, it depends on, on what you do. But most of the time, a knife can't really be too big, but it can be too small. Like, see, I'm making a, a cut like that, and, and I'm, I'm pretty much using all the knife. Next week, he's using a sword. But a small knife, you'd, you'd, you'd be chopping, you know. So, now. We don't want to chop. We want to keep them in strips. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. And then this is, and then, and too, you can keep the point of the knife on the board, and, and it, and it kind of pivots on the point, and, and, uh, Acts like a like a chopper. Now I have to ask you a question. Yeah. Which one of the flavors, the chicken or the sausage, will be more predominant? Oh, the sausage by far. Will it? By far, yeah. Chicken is very mild. Okay. And if it weren't for the for the for the peppers and the onion and 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 whatnot, the, the the chicken would be nothing. But the, but this is this is much more I predominant. See. Now, okay. because this is a very expensive show, we have two walks. Wow. Yeah. John, would you mind very much if I just looked in the refrigerator to see what's in there? You keep going. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. And then as you move over, I can put it's this okay. on here. It's okay. okay. Uh, nothing but onions. <laughs> okay. You've got to get at this, at this and get this dish finished here. Okay. Or we're going to be out of time. That's another couple of tablespoons full of, uh, of vegetable oil. Right. Vegetable oil. Now, there's, there's no cholesterol in this dish because we have all... Uh, all um, uh, vegetable oil. Is there a reason why you use vegetable oil versus olive oil? I mean, everybody's on this olive oil craze. Well, no, lately. olive oil would be all right, except you can't get olive oil near as hot. It burns Ooh. at a very low temperature, and uh -huh. so uh, so I use the, the vegetable oil. Now this is a this is a safflower oil we've got here. And, now, does uh, this, depending on like if it was a peanut oil, does this affect the taste? Only for an elephant. <laughs> Not really, no, no. Most of your vegetable oils all pretty much taste the same. Yes. Uh, olive oil might have a little different, a little milder, milder taste to it. But most of your other vegetable oils, oils are pretty much the same. Okay, now we've got to get the. Uh, now you say okay, meaning what? What is it now? What? Why are you stopping from stirring it right now? Uh, I really don't know, Joey. I just it was time to stop stirring it. But it means that it, it's ready, or no. what? No, we've got to do this until this chicken gets brown. Oh. It's got to be, be brown because gray chicken is, yes. is, not, is not very appetizing. This so, isn't slippery chicken, is it? No, no, this is not slippery chicken either. So as a chef, would you then leave this and then do something and, until it got brown? Or no, no, it? you've got to keep moving it around That's like what this. I want Oh, to yeah, because this, right. this, this pan is very hot in the center and right. it gets cooler towards the outside. Yeah. And so you're, you're, you're moving it around all the time. And... Uh, do you know just approximately the, how long it takes for it to get brown? Oh, three minutes. Because from the lights we've got here, Barbara and I turned brown two minutes ago. <laughs> okay, so we're, now we're going to put our... Uh, now our, it's our brown. Kosher, no, it's not brown. It's no. not brown. But we're going to put our kosher... Um, Hot dog. Uh, kosher... It's sausage. Sausage. It's sausage. It's sausage, yeah. It's, it's actually Polish sausage. Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. So... This is going to sound like a really dumb question. What? But what does kosher really mean? Kosher means that we are only allowed to eat from certain parts of the animal, for oh. example. And when he said sausage, I didn't want to correct him because sausage comes from pigs. No, this beef sausage. Beef sausage. This is all beef, kosher sausage. Oh, yeah. I see. Okay. The rabbi has done his thing with this sausage right here. Oh, man, that is looking good. good. Oh, that is looking so good. Yeah, no chance of meeting the rabbi, is there? Yeah. Well, it's probably could. <laughs> now, see how it's yeah. starting to get brown there, Joey? Huh? Yeah, that's... That's getting brown. And, 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 and now you can now you can smell the garlic and all that good stuff and the sausage coming off of yeah. that. Well, it's, it's tough just, because Barbara smells pretty nice here, too, you yeah. know. So I'm getting a whiff of perfume and I'm getting a whiff of you and your Joey, chicken. Joey, you and I are too old for that kind of thing. You know that. What? To... to, to, to to en enjoy the aroma of a, a woman? No, no, I guess not. I guess not. I'll, John, I'll, it's up I'll to you. If you want to smell chicken, then man, that's <laughs> your privilege. That I'd rather smell no, We're going to go with a little salt on here again. A little, a little salt. salt. <laughs> that's right. Well, no, you've got to have a little salt. You know, the reason for this, is Barbara, is he's got a house full of salt, and he's going to get rid of it. And a little bit of the crushed pepper. Now, this is jambalaya, you know. And, jambalaya. And, and you're supposed to. It's got to be spicy, right? It's got to cover up the taste of the, of the, of the weak old shrimp. Yeah. Right. So. Uh, no pepper, though. No pepper. Just no the pepper. red pepper. Just the red just pepper. Just the red pepper. Hotsy potsy. Now, now we're just about there. Oh. We are just about there now. Now, we are almost there. Mm, that does smell great. Yeah, that is great. Yeah. Now, what we're going to do is... Now, we're going to let this go another minute. We can let this go a little yeah. bit more. But while we're doing that, I'll just, just leave that there for just a second. I'm going to get out the little, the little pan here. 
and we're going to put some, some hot water in here. No, we're not going to put the hot water in there. We're going we're to measure the hot water because this recipe has a little bit of a, a little bit of um, rice how, in it. How much hot water are you going to put in there? Three quarters then? of a cup. Three quarters of a cup. Yeah, exactly. Three quarters of a cup right yeah. there. Now we're going to put this over in this other burner. And I hope that doesn't burn you, Joey. I, uh, no, it's okay. No, it's all right. Because that's a... Yeah, okay. Right. Now, wh why are we preparing this water for what reason? For the rice. We're gonna, oh, we got rice coming in Rice here. goes in there, that's yeah. That's right. You know, the rice, they grow rice down yeah. by New Orleans. Uh, in fact, I have some very good friends in Lafayette, uh, Louisiana, that uh, grow rice. They got, yeah. they got very rich growing rice. Yeah. And let's not forget, Uncle Ben is a credit to his rice. Don't say Uncle Ben. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Cut it out. <laughs> All right, all right. So how, uh, how many this, people will this be? This is for four. This is for four. Now we're going to just put this in there. I can't believe That's it. a lot of food for four people. Well, it's for four hungry people. All right. Yeah. Now. If now. you look at John, it's not a lot of food for four people. Now we're going to get our... for you and I. <laughs> for you and I. For John, this could be a whole meal. Don't say anything. I wonder what time he returns no, the gotta... rock. Are you guys paying attention now? Well, of course. What do you okay, think we Okay, okay. Now, what we've got here... You want here, to ask questions later? We've got we'll some white here. wine. White except, wine? Except this is white uh, grape juice. Oh. Or you can use white wine. This is I some see. chicken broth. And this is some tomato puree. puree. You're using grape juice instead of wine. Yeah, yeah. Cheap, yeah. cheap, cheap. Well, oh, hey, here we go. <laughs> we Don't say anything. We got our, our, our water's boiling for our rice already. Oh, how about that? See that? See how oh, quick the, that? Um, so the, now what we're, we're going to do is... You're talking... Put the rice in there. Refrigerator right. is calling. Oh, the refrigerator is... Joey, we got to close the refrigerator oh, door. I didn't open it, but we got to close it. Right. You hear this, Bobby? You hear what's going on here? <laughs> this could cost me my career. It's all right. No, this refrigerator is great because yeah. if you leave the door open, yes, it'll it'll tell you it's open. Go yeah. close the door. Wouldn't that be a good good system for your house, John? Yeah, yeah. Now, see, we've we've mixed that around. Now we just put the lid on this and uh, let it stand for approximately four or five minutes. So that's that's is so much for the rice. Is instant rice you're making? Instant rice, right? Instant rice. And okay. now we're going to oh. put a half a cup of uh, chicken. Now I made this chicken broth earlier, and uh, chicken uh, soup. It's actually a chicken stock, is what it is. Ah, and we need a half a cup. Is a half a cup. How do you make chicken stock? Well, it's got some, uh, first some, some chicken, chicken uh, concentrate, which you can buy in a bottle, yes. and some onion, and thyme, and uh, uh, peppercorns. How much time? And, uh, don't take long. Don't take oh, about long. half an hour, I guess. Yeah, half an hour, I maybe. No, no, don't take that. My long. mother once had two chickens, and one chicken was sick, so she killed the other chicken to make chicken soup for the sick chicken. No, now we've got a, a half, long time ago. But we've got a half a cup of the of the of the of the wait till the laugh dies down, John. <laughs> Oh, did you say something to say? No. You're running by Forget me again, John. I wouldn't talk right. to a guy that little, sells me grape juice salt. for wine. <laughs> a little salt. He always says a little, but we don't know what more. you mean by a little. Well, just some, you know, some. a pinch. A, a pinch. pinch. To be specific. Ooh, Barbara, you heard that? To be specific. A pinch. A pinch. Stand now, by, Barbara. Now, we've got, to have a, uh, we've got to have half a cup of this. This is tomato puree, which you get in a can. He always says we, and he does everything. Right. Well, I have yeah. a problem. Yeah. We got to do this. We got to do that. Right. And he's yeah, doing okay. it. We're standing okay. here. All right. Now. Oh, that looks good. No, no, no. This is kind of a. This is actually kind of a gravy that's going to go on, on our uh, our other stuff. Okay. Yeah. Now we need, uh, and we've got that already here. There's about three tablespoons full of. Uh, Flour there. We have no fire here. Bar Barbara, did you turn that fire out? No, sir. Oh, I don't. Boy. That's oh, the boy. kitchen. You know, that's that's the why we're here. In case something goes wrong, we've got somebody to blame. You bet. That's why when, don't guests, say anything, when, when guests come early, when you're fixing dinner and they're in the kitchen bothering you, it's very hard to do anything right. You know, it really is. Oh. If he, yeah. he's asking me to leave in a nice, polite way. Oh, right? Joey, we love you. We love you, Joey. Just make no. me a sandwich. I'll get out no, of here. No, no, no. Okay, okay. Fortunately, though, this is a, this is, 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 is a very strong fire, so this is going to happen real quick here. You know, we're awfully close to having this finished. You know that? Really? Yeah, we really are. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I, I must tell you, it's been very interesting. I'm, I'm joking and joking, but this is really... Uh, you, you, you explained it well, John. Well, oh, have I? Well, yeah. yeah. I was okay. under the impression chefs were like impatient. You take your time, you tell us everything right. All right. Now, what have we got in here? We've got our... Uh, you better be asking us what we no, got. We've got our, well, we you asked him if he was going to ask us questions. Oh, we, we, we need a little bit of, of margarine. I was just going to say, John, need don't margarine. we need margarine? I'm just going to say that, but I think yeah. I better not butt in. It's yeah, his kitchen. We need margarine. It's the village kitchen, right? Yeah. Right. When do the village people show up? <laughs> probably, about, probably about oh three or four tablespoons full of margarine. How's three that? or four. How's that? How's that? Okay. Yeah, that looks good. To me. 
I don't know. He takes out a ladle and he scoops it and he says three or three or four spoons, right? Well, you can't. He knows that. See, we don't know that. I but know. I'm sure the people who are going to. No, we've got this. this written down. We've got this all written down. That's what's important. Oh, yeah. yeah absolutely. I saw, absolutely. Yeah, recipes. Got it written down. Yeah, we have right. recipes. So if people that are watching us want this recipe, can they write to us? Well, sure they can. That, okay. That's one way we can find out whether anybody's watching us. Okay. Oh, they'll be watching. People are very interested in cooking, John. I think so, Joy. Oh, yes, sir. Now, yes, look, sir. see how this is thickening up now with this, with this flour in here? This John, is, isn't that lumpy? Uh, no, it's not lumpy. Those are very small dumplings we have well, in Shouldn't they be called lumplings? Well, maybe so, Joy. Just trying know, to help, anyway. John. But this is, this is just all about ready to serve now. And so we're going to clear off a little space over here, and we're going to okay. serve this. What about our rice? Oh, my gosh, our rice. Oh, God. Here's our rice. Here's our rice. You know, we'd have, we'd, have, we'd have completely forgotten the rice if you hadn't have, had no mentioned worries, rice. Bro. Keep the Look rice hanging in case somebody beautiful. decides to get married on this show. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> that looks great. All Smells right. wonderful. All right. Where are you going, Barbara? Okay. <laughs> I knew he had another plate hidden somewhere. <laughs> well, you get all those lumps out of there. Oh, that's not lumps. Now leave those lumps alone. They're, they're no, dumplings. that's very good. Are lumplings, you kidding? Lumplings, okay. You want to be honest, I came here just for the, <laughs> just for the lumps. Lumplings, okay. Right, that's okay, my real reason okay, for being okay. here. Okay. All right, it's all done now. All right, now we've got to... Do what another one here. Serving the camera crew while we are standing here? Well, no, 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 no. We got the third one. Here, we got the third one right now. And okay. then all three of us are going to sit down and we're going to eat this. Okay. And uh, here, Barbara, here's a fork for you. Thank you. I'm and trying I have to, a fork. And John, <laughs> I'm trying two. to pick this right hand up, but I can't with my right hand. I told you he'd get weak. <laughs> well. His sugar must be dropping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've got your fork. A little rice in the, here here in the middle. Oh, Don't forget the. Uh, yeah. Great. The gravy or the whatever rice in the mid Yeah, that's the, this is the gravy. This right. is the hot stuff here. Oops, I better get it this way. That's yeah. some spicy stuff. Yeah, oh, it's very spicy. It has to be. Right. Jambalaya right. is spicy, yeah, yeah. Right. Okay, yeah, now. This will be a good time for us to taste All right, it. now this is it. So what do you, what do you, what do you, what do you, what do you oh, thank you, Joy. What do you think here? Okay, we'll let you what know. What do you think? Uh -oh. We'll let you know. Boy, you're not taking much of a chance, are you? Mm. Oh, let's see how it is. John, mm. big winner. All right. Big winner. All this right. This is great. You've forgotten something. You liked it? I loved it. Then why don't you let the other people get the recipe so they can make it? Good idea. Are you going to put flour in that? Boy, what are we doing? 